Our recent bout of colder weather has led some people to think it killed those annoying bugs. You'd have to have several days, you know, two, three weeks of really sub freezing temperatures in order to have any significant impact. Eric Roberts, district manager of Dodson Pest Control in Bluntville, has worked in the business for 34 years. He says the cold does not have much of an effect on the insect population. I've never had a year that due to a brutal or extreme cold winter that uh, coming into the springtime the you know phone didn't ring because of cold weather. In fact, he says most insects actually find ways to survive outside. The tall grass like that, you get into dead grass clippings and things like that. Uh, insects can hide under that and harbor and that'd be more than plenty to, uh, you know, keep them safe. Fleas, ticks, mosquitoes and stinging insects also don't have a problem. Female yellow jacket is actually, uh, she is fertilized in the fall time of the year and she will go into a semi-hibernation state through the winter and the wasp are similar. They uh, survive under loose fitting bark of trees and things like that. As for ladybugs, you'll often find them in the walls of homes. They'll also uh, spend the winter time uh, in shelters, uh, you know, like outbuildings and things like that. So uh, they really don't have any problem surviving. According to Roberts, homeowners can pick up limbs, leaves, and remove tree stumps if possible to help control the pest population. That would eliminate um, uh, areas that uh, insects could seek shelter. But nothing can eliminate them from crawling near or in your home. The pests are not, they're going to be here, yeah. The bottom line, while some insects won't survive the cold, the vast majority of insects have no trouble at all uh, making it through the winter months. Tyler Allender, News Channel 11.